Really? You know, I'm feeling a little funny today. I don't know what it is. Is there something <laughs> on my head? I feel like a little weird. I thought you said you refused to wear that. Well, I can wear it on camera because I look good. I make this look good, guys. I don't know what this is. All of a sudden, I don't woke be. up. I woke up in the, and don't be a shithead. I, I, all don't of a sudden, be a I woke up emoji. I, I got something on my head. What's on my head, Ange? I don't see it. I feel I like know. the guy back there. You said you were cold. You didn't have your hat. Oh my god, it is rather warm. It it's is like nice and toasty, warm, isn't it? It's warm poop. Yo, Danny, how are you? It fits my head very nice. It does fit your head really nice. Are you trying to say I'm a poo head? Yeah, you are. Don't be a poop head. Don't be a poop head. How do you think you like it's got the Joe, it's I got know. The Hello. It's by the back by the, the book. It's Timothy, how you doing? RJ DC. I got an early Christmas. It is a poo present. hat, Christina. I make <laughs> I make this look good. Look at that point on it. Timu Hall. <laughs> Timu got the craziest. So I'm gonna try to drive around with this to see if it, it affects my driving, my vision. Why would it affect anything? It's it's a lot. It's what a lot. is that it's hat? A it's a poop emoji head. Look at he's a poop emoji. We're gonna see him walk see, around with I, it. I am not walking. Yes, around. you gotta go inside the place to get it. They're probably they'll probably laugh and give you extra. I'm wearing the hell out of this thing. Is there something Hi, there? Lori Lou. <laughs> smell me. How do I smell? You smell like caca. Leather. Leather. Hi, David Bangor. M. Zabrano. How are you? Didn't it? You will stay warm, Joe. He left his ball cap upstairs. We'll do that again. Well, he told me to get it, but there was drama. And so then I came downstairs because I needed to get out of the drama. And then Joe decided to park the car. And then he went upstairs. I said, stay out of the drama. And then he took forever. So then I'm texting him. I'm like, get your butt down here. You're choking from laughing so much, Danny. I know. It's Danny, so crazy. You got to get one of these. Show. These things are nice. Coffee Joe is too classy for that heck. Come on. <laughs> yes. I think it's funny. Don't be a poop head. Don't be a poop head. I know, Robert. I know. Isn't it funny, though? It's kind of silly. I love silly stuff sometimes. And you know how much that was? It was $6.49. That's a lot of money for Timo. That was a, that was high spendy. That was high spending. But I thought it was hilarious. For $6? I was like, $6? Six bucks. I was like, let's go. Hey, Dahlia Road. I might get overheated. <laughs> I know, Paula. Don't you love it? <laughs> I can't. We're going to look and see what we're doing. Blue skies. It's blue skies today. But I'm going to tell you, it's freaking cold, man. This guy's got 100 yards to put that car in there. He can't figure it out. <sighs> he can't figure it out. And he's got a backup camera to boot. Yeah, he's got a backup camera to boot. People are going to think that you have like a helmet on. Like you have a problem or something. It's my poop helmet. It's your poop helmet? I like the smell of the car. I can't smell anything. It smells like leather. But you got those little things. Those don't smell as good as the they other do. things. No, they don't. They do. I smell them really good. No, that thing jingly jangly. I know it's jingly jangly. That's in the wrong good. spot. You got to put it somewhere else. No, it's uh, okay. No. I'll try something. You got to put it on like the thing over here. No, you can't. No, you can't have it up there. We tried this before. I know. I think we we usually hung it like on one of these things. Or we hung it down here. Oh, God, don't do it now. You're going to knock everything out. Oh, my God. Joe's trying to take the air freshener down. He went and got the car washed, guys. Okay, now you're going to... Okay, okay, now you got it jammed up because you probably put it on there so hard. Okay, why don't we just leave it alone? Oh, see? No, nope. Joe, got to drive the car. Joe, drive the car. Drive the car. Hi, Joey and Cora. How are you? Joe's fiddly diddling. Hi, Karina. All that, see that? That's the air freshener. Do you like that swingy motion there in the camera? Because Joe thought, we're going to hang it up here like everybody else does because that's a fabulous spot. Looks so great. Thanks, Joe. It's fabulous. Oh my God. Where are you going? Where are you going? 
You told me, okay, fine. I'm going to Queensboro. All right, I thought you were gonna go get bacon, egg, and cheese, or coffee, or something. Oh, look at that, sweet wingy. <laughs> Swingy wingy. I think it's off the chain annoying. <laughs> oh, is it annoying, Joe? Off the chain see, annoying. See, annoying to our viewers, because it's like a tick -tock, tick -tock. all they see is a swinging thing in the way. Oh my God, this is so annoying. Oh my God, oh my God. so annoying. What did you do? Joseph, did you like double loop it? No, I just single looped it. Then why is it stuck? I don't know. There we go. Let's try it again. So you just, oh well, no, now you're just tying a fucking, not, now you just ripped it off because you couldn't take it anymore. Give it to me. No. Just give it to me. I can't. Do you love the sound too of it swinging around? Yeah, exactly. I told him, this is not the way to do it. He didn't believe me. He thought that we needed to hang it from the middle. So we constantly look at that. Okay, now we got a shorter leash. A shorter leash. It's elastic though, Joe. Still shorter. Yeah, okay, well, we're gonna see if this works over by Joe. Joe's gonna find that so annoying where he's about to put it. Okay. Okay. Wonderful. Now it's over by Joe, and he's gonna say, "This thing's in my eye line." <laughs> it's totally in my eye line. It's totally in my eye line, and I hate it. Although it's not making noise. I know. Now it's not making noise though. But it's like totally pissing me off. I know you can't handle it with that swinging thing back and forth. But he thought it'd be great on the rearview mirror. Do you know what he did one time? This is funny, guys. Joe thought. And I remember you doing this, and I was like, Joe, that's not what you do. He actually decided one time that rear view mirrors were optional. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> and I was like, I got in the car to drive it, and he had removed the rear view mirror. <laughs> because you want to know why? It pissed me off. Because he wanted an unobstructed view out of the front window. I wanted a clear front window. And I window. said, but bitch, I can't look out the back window. He you goes, got side mirrors. He goes, side mirrors, just turn around. I'm like, are you kidding me? Josh is feeling good, Rhonda. But he was just being dramatic, that's all, you know. He's drama queen. He's drama queen, and this is the, you know, Joe's the other drama, so. I just sit there and stare at him. Hi, Coco Rayo. I swear to God. Joe, you're going through yellow. Don't do it. <sighs> Don't do it, dude. Don't do it. Don't go through the yellow. Hopefully your son is. Yes, he is doing well. He's doing so well. He's creating a dramatic argument. That's what he was doing upstairs. And I told Joe, please stay out of any drama. Get my head off. Oh, you warm? And then smoking. Joe was up there for about 10 minutes and I had to start texting him like, what are you doing? And then he didn't respond. And then I had to call him from the lobby and be like, what are you doing? And then, well, uh, and I could hear Josh ranting in the background. And then ranting. I'm like, I'm like, remove yourself and go downstairs. And then he didn't say anything. And I'm like, he's probably still up there. Hi, Paradise Heaven, Angelo. Hello, hello. Please don't say hi back. Don't say hi back, I already said hi. You don't want me to say hello to you? Hi, Gallivanters. Guys, if I don't catch your name, it's because I'm paying attention to a million things. Oh, we're not getting Starbucks today. Changed my mind. That's why Joe has that on his head, he's special. Yeah, he's special today. I thought you'd like that. Um, we're going what through. What is going on with these yellows? I don't know. Apparently, you suck today with the with the lights. Maybe April Fool's Day it will be warmer. Really, I know. Yeah, he really did earn that today. So I had to tell him get downstairs. So he finally got downstairs. Anyway, but yeah. One one time he decided he didn't want to have a rear view mirror. What car was that on? That was not your car, it was my car. Was it the Liberty? Hi, enjoy Nantucket. You know what? It was a Liberty. I think it was in Minnesota I tried this stunt. Yeah, it was not here. It was, no, it was in Minnesota, it wasn't in Michigan. It was, it was Minnesota. I tried that stunt in Minnesota. Hi, Tony. Leela, how are you doing? Hi, Leela. Oh, I have to scroll back up, Danny, it's too far. 
Danny, it's a long chat. And when I'm chat. driving, I can't like, when he's driving, I can't like scroll. Cause then I get lost and then I, I start hitting buttons and people get deleted. <laughs> What? What is Joe wearing on the thumbnail? That is a poop emoji hat. I know, no rear view mirror. Did you hear about the kid Riley in Tennessee? No, I didn't hear anything of that. I have not paid attention to any news or anything. The news is tough to watch sometimes. I was busy doing a video, busy taking care of other stuff, doing my taxes, yikes. When I'm doing that stuff, your name is Green. Gail, welcome to the Yo Club. Yay, Gail, thank you so much for joining the Yo Club, Gail. Truly appreciate that. Polish food, where are we going, Pops? We are gonna go to Greenpoint. I'm trying to scroll up now, poop it. How was work today? Was it a shitty day? Hey, Danny wanted to know, was it a poopy day? It was just a day. Hey, BBE. It was just a day. It was just a regular day. It was just a okay, day. Okay, we're going to go in front of these people. Well, that's a weird turn signal that dude's got. He's got like three things going at the oh, same time. The park. I, it is, but it's freaking cold. It makes me want to just warm up in a damn big freaking blanket. Why is it got to be so cold? It's super cold. It was 31 <coughs> degrees this morning. 31. I know. It's making that. 31. It is beautiful, but it's cold. 31. What is it now? 42. With 42 high... with wind. But Look at Joe's even sleepy. You need wind. to get coffee. I do. I'm not spending a Starbucks coffee 750 a piece and I refuse. I refuse. Starbucks is no longer fiscally responsible. No. It's 750 a coffee. Why is it so much here? You know, it's going to be the same price when I go to Vegas, too. Oh, Actually, you know, it's not. You want to know why? Because we will never find coffee there. That's right. So I am refusing boycotting Starbucks. Because Hi, it's Isaac. Too Hi, expensive. Ernesto. Welcome in, everybody. 12, it is date night. It's 12 to $16. To I dare him called. to wear it to the restaurant, too. That would be funny. People will laugh. I think they will. I think they'll, they'll be like, okay, Joe, we see that you did a little extra today. I was just going to wear it, but then he decided, so now it's on him. It's on me. It's on you. It's literally on me. I actually thought this would be perfect for when you're in the plane. It's like a little pillow built in. Yeah, it's cozy. It's warm. And then I put on my sleeping mask. It's even better. Who do you want me to talk to? The lady in the poop head. Oh, I know who that is. I see that. Mm -hmm. There's who nobody, keeps ringing the bell? There's nobody else. The poop emoji. On the plane who's going to wear a poop head. Nobody. You are by yourself in that one. You know what? Joe always calls me all the time. And it does fit with like what today we're going to go get is the Polish food. But. He says dupe ahead. Now. Means we're exactly in the game that. now for. That bagels place there could have coffee. I might be in the game, but it's right in front There's of us. There's a Starbucks stop. right here. Starbucks, what did I say? Are you listening? Wait, I forgot. Angela doesn't listen to me. Doesn't but you don't love me for Starbucks, huh? No, it's not about love. Is that because I'm paying He hasn't for had it. a quad shot. No, he has had no shot. No, it's just standard Starbucks with heavy cream is seven fifty a piece. So I get to have crappy coffee. You'll get crappy coffee. I don't want crappy coffee. You get you're not wearing that shirt, so you can't say that. Really? Yeah. Mm. Grabsteins. Grabsteins baked bagels. Doesn't look authentic. Grabstein? It makes it look like they try to be authentic, but that's not been there very long. It looks very new. Grabstein. It needs to have a little dusty, that rusty going on. That does not roll off your tongue. Grabsteins. Grabstein. Go grab your steam. Grab your stein. Grab steins. That does not roll off your tongue either. Grab steins. I got some. Crystal, grab. hello, hello. I got Max, something to good grab. to see you. Joseph you Patron, grab done something? with dinner, can chat now. Yeah. What'd you have, Joseph? Me? You had I've early had dinner. Nothing. I've had nothing. I get nothing. What? I've had Look, nothing. Look, there's another Starbucks. I think we've passed three Starbucks, maybe four. I'll get you a Starbucks out to pull it over there. 
No, it's okay. You don't have to give me a Starbucks. No, you're gonna We're not in the area. You're, you're not close you're, to it. Right there's a No, that's spot. too far. You got to cross the street. Guilt, that's a danger you're zone. You're gonna guilt me out. No. Nope. You get your Starbucks. No. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. You're gonna guilt me. No. Nope. Guilt. Guilt. No. Nope. Guilt. No. Nope. No nope. guilt. Nope. No nope. guilt. Nope. 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 I'm gonna guilt everybody to get what I want. No. Oh my it's God. Hi, Ronnie C. It's a technique you use all the time. Brats and tots are in the air for. Oh, brats and tots. Mm -hmm. Got one of those kind of meals going on. Those are always good because you know why? You don't have to think about it. I love tots. I love tots too. I miss them. Oh, look at there's a ping pong place right there. Ping pod. Ping pod is popping up all over the place. <laughs> Robert says, What's the big deal about banging the garbage cans in the chat while I'm trying to take a nap? Well, Robert, wake the hell up. It's not sleepy time yet. You don't work a midnight shift, do you? If you do, then I'm gonna apologize a little bit. What's going on? That's I'm gonna shut your gas off, truck. Nobody wants why to see that truck the, in there. Why does it get the flashers all over That's the place? His Con Ed gas truck shut off the gas. Last night, Joe digging in the street made That's us watch a Disney the jungle movie. Book. The it was Jungle good. Book. I was tearing up. I didn't think it was that good. I was tearing up. It was the, like, how, what do they call that? Not like in real life, but it's like the, I don't know what it's called. Like where they use real people and then they have the bears and everybody else, like the animals are animated. Like they're supposed to, it's all CGI stuff. And then, you know, you got like Ben Kingsley's Bagheera. I'm and like, then you have, um. Bill Murray is Baloo. I know, but it's it doesn't make it's stupid. I hate those. Those are not good. They're just not good. They're not good. Oh, look at Robert Kaczynski shouting everybody out. I tried taking a nap. My brother all called on the phone. Oh my god. Well, there's marinara. I heard marinara is actually really good. This is classic Angela. Uh, there's no way. There's I can a lot stop of them, but I want to know which one is better. She Apparently says, they have this chicken that's parm, really good. And I, this I, chicken I parm dish it. that looks really damn delicious. I almost would go get it as I pass it. I know we passed it. Already. Suck. I know. Suck. I'm really kind of hungry. You suck. Okay, but we don't get it because we're way past it now. Tall bagels. Tall bagels. That sounds like you're saying tall bagels. Where are we in the cafe? No. Look, you pick these places out that look like crap. Because it's at a stop sign. It's at a stop Oh, that's light. where they put all the crappy places. You want to go to this cafe? Yeah, with all the little dingly dangly lights. It's crazy. Hi, Daryl. Kenny should be at the hotel bar soon. Yeah, Kenny is at the hotel bar probably. He's at his convention. There's Eli Zabar's. Want to go there? No. I don't think it's going to be any good. Hi, Rachel. How are you? Jeeps don't have reverse or turn options. No, like once Joe goes past something, it's done. It's in the books. It's sealed. It's never to be seen again. We've passed it. It is no good. It's now expired. That's exactly how it goes. Hi, ABX. You don't see me complaining, dude. No, he's not even retorting against it. He's just saying the same thing. He's just he's just agreeing by not even saying anything. Cold weather equals more food. I know Timothy, but he's giving us nothing. He basically said we get nothing. We just starve. We starve. Krispy Kreme. Oh, that's a tiny Krispy Kreme. I thought it was a big one. It's a little bitty one. Is Paris baguette really that good? Where are you going? Starbucks. I'm sick to tell you you're complaining. Oh, well, why don't you just pull it? Okay, never mind. Okay, you gonna go through? What are you doing? You gonna run the lady run over? Run the lady over. Okay, she's just standing there in the way. Oh no, no, she took one step back. Oh, maybe she go on the sidewalk. Okay, dokie. <laughs> Hopefully, the ambulance doesn't need to get the back doors. What you gonna get me? What you gonna get me? What you gonna get me? Oh, he just like walked away. You didn't see? You forgot your hat. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm dead. I want to see people's faces. 
He's walking in there with the poop hat, guys. <laughs> I get nothing. Hey, Christopher. Jill's getting me a coffee. He's gonna get it because he can't. He can't find a coffee for his life. But I'm cracking up that he literally went in there with the thing on. Oh my god. Yo. Is it five yet? No, it's not. It's 4.53. We came on early. No, he went in there with it on. Yo, guys, that's funny shit. That's really hot. That, I'm cracking up, man. Are you dead? I'm dead. Leela, it's pretty funny. They, they won't even blink. This is what New York is. I swear to God, Timothy, you're right. You, they won't even blink at it. Now, if we were to walk around anywhere else, they would be like, what the hell? It looks like George Costanza's Ukrainian winter hat. <laughs> no one will care about the poop hat. They'll just be like, what? No, nothing bothers, nothing bothers Joe anymore. Just about, he knows it. He's like, it's fine, whatever. It's part of the gig. <laughs> nothing bothers me anymore. I used to be super paranoid. Hey, Michelle, isn't it funny? Look at, they're not even saying anything. I mean, everybody looks ridiculous anyway in the winter. Hi, Amy. Let's see what happens when he comes out. Do 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 do. We need like an emoji song or something for that. It's funny. I turn her. I turn the camera around, but you know what? We got all the fire trucks coming up behind us. Dang. Who's on fire? I want to see, I can't see him because the windows are so tinted that I can't see. Oh, he's still got it on. He's at the counter. <laughs> he's at the counter. That's so funny. Gail, I'm dead. Wait, are they talking? I think they're talking about it. I think they're talking about it. Because <laughs> he pointed to his hat. <laughs> Buffalo Wild Wings opening across the street. What? Oh, it is. It is the Fly NYC. Yeah, he wore it into Starbucks. Don't be a poop head. Don't be a dupa. Don't be a dupa. Opening soon, Buffalo Wild Wings. Well, this is the east side. We already have stuff on our side. We have that on our side, which is fine. Buffalo, wait, do we have, no, we don't. We have the other wing place, wing stop. We don't have Buffalo Wild Wings. Will that just be a to-go thing? That would be cool. Because I like to-go places because nobody wants to eat inside Buffalo Wild Wings, really. It's a conversation starter, absolutely, right? Hey, Marge. Poops in the chat. Yeah, but the poops in the chat. No woman allowed in that ambulance. Yeah, it's, it's uh, I don't know. I don't know. USS New Jersey is dry docking in two days and Joe has thick armor. Coincidence? I don't know. Is he drinking? What is he doing? It's taking forever. Oh, the ambulance, do not security. I thought that was the ambulance, dude. Oh my goodness. How you doing, Marge? Here he comes. Oh, he got himself. <laughs> I can't. Wicked Betty. I'm dead. <laughs> did you by chance get yourself a coffee? I did. Oh, did they, did they comment? Everybody did. <laughs> I told everybody it's a dear and my wife I sell take it. I know you go AOL for a few days and look what you stumble into. Mm. Patty. Mm. Makes my head very hot. It does. Did everybody like it? Everybody's laughing. There you go. See, we were gonna put smiles on people's faces today. Everybody's like, what the fuck? They came out from the back room too. Did they really? Everybody yeah. loves it. Yeah. It's yeah. a yeah. hit. What is that? Is it? It's a poop hat. It's a poop emoji. 
It's a poop emoji. It's a poop. It's poo. <laughs> Come on. If somebody walked in with that, would you not die laughing if you worked there? These people are bored beyond. Come on. You work at Starbucks. It's really, de it's delicious. I made sure it was made correctly. Before I took it with it's my poop hat, I said, are there two pumps of sugar-free milk and heavy cream? Because yes, it's great. I'm dead. This is where we have to, you have to do that. Because you know what? It makes people's day. I do think I made somebody's day today. Because they're, they're at work. They're like, oh, shit. oh what? You, you, you drive home. They said, um, did you know what you look like? He seriously went in there with the poop said, Yes, it's a he dare. Did. I said, it's a dare. It's a dare. You know how dares work, especially with the spouse. Spousal dares are huge. But was it really a dare? I don't think it was a dare. Oh, it was classified as a dare. I think it was just do it. <laughs> just posted the Discord. <laughs> I love it. It was classified as a dare. <laughs> Hi, Jonathan Richard. Subbed for the poop hat. Thank you, Tyrell. <laughs> This is did what our hat, channel brings did the poop you. Did make your day? We're going to be wearing that everywhere. I'm going to be wearing that thing in Vegas. You lie. You're you not think I'm not going to wear it in I Vegas? I think you're full of poop. I'm going to wear it in Vegas all the time. I think you're full I'm going to sit there. I think you're full of poop. Just wait. Just wait. Imagine the smiles you make with that are amazing. You just have to let you know that. Smile. Gail, do you, are you, if you're, Gail, if you're on Facebook... Or just email me. I'll send you. I'll put up a new link for Discord. I usually do it every Friday. I put up a new link for Discord because it does expire. So your coffee. That's good? how I can. Yeah, my coffee's great. Losing a bet. I know you can't lose. By the a way, bet. the yeah. Lexington Candy Shop. Yeah, it's just there because it's just there. It's there because it's got vintage neon. I know. I know. The light I'll outside wear it in the I'll, sun I'll, is incredible. Hey, we'll wear it in there. Uh, yeah. Double dog dare us to wear that into the thing. Absolutely. I wore it into a Starbucks. How much more public can you get? I'll wear it at a restaurant just for people. They would be like cracking Well, you got to be careful eating with it. <laughs> Hello from Cajun Company. It's got a lip on Cajun it. Country. Ooh, hey, Jonathan. Hey. I want to have a Cajun seafood boil, like a really good one. Go to Nice. The knows where all the No, but I want is. a really good one. Those are in Philly and stuff. I want one from like. Trying to say Philly does not boil? No, it's not. You know what I mean? No, I don't. I don't know. Maybe that's yeah. good. I don't know. Hi, Shaquille. Uh, I'll tell you one thing. It looks disgusting. But the only thing is I can't have the potatoes and the corn. It looks like a latex bag or something. It's gross. Well, it's a bag full it's of disgusting. seafood. Disgusting. Why don't we just go to the Queen Seafood Company or whatever the hell that's called? It is so utterly disgusting. I can't even explain. This is you the loved it there. It is you loved it there. Good you know you did. Oh, I loved it where? At the seafood, Astoria Seafood. <laughs> I'll wear my poop hat there. I'll go behind the counter and cook over there because that's how I feel. No, like a poop don't head. damage the poop hat. Don't damage the, the poop head. Poop smell like fish. Don't be a dupe head. So it's like cat poo. Smell like fish. Yeah, I want it from New Orleans. I want somebody from New Orleans to make it or something oh, like that. Authentic. I want authenticness. You had Starbucks this morning, Cajun Boudin today. What is that? I don't know. It sounds good, though. Redfish and gumbo. Get another that one and wear them together. Good. A couple of poo heads. We'll be a couple of dupas. That sounds delish. I should get another one. It was only $6.49 on Timu. Can you guys want to see... you imagine a pair of dupas walking around? If you guys want to see what I got in Timu, check out my video I just posted today. You can see it. I know a lot of people don't like Timu. I understand that. And they think that, you know, you don't have to get all the damn notifications because I know they notification you out. They want to make sure you know that they're still around. I yes. swear to God. I think I get like two or three notifications every damn day. Thank God we don't get charged for text messages. You know? Yeah. Ooh, you make mean jambalaya. Jambalaya. Barbecue red fries is isn't killer. Cajun, isn't Ooh, Roma check, Cajun? what you doing? Roma Rad check. Do you, see, do you see my new hat? Oh, a seafood buffet. You got to check out my new hat, Roma check. It's in the... Um, do you see those dogs? That's a sheep dog. What's it called at the beginning of the video? It's called the, um, the picture. A dupa head? No, what's it, what's it called, though? A thumbnail? Thumbnail. It's in oh. my thumbnail. Check out the thumbnail, Roma check. Good afternoon, Motor City. That's a mini. Locomotix. That's oh, a mini I can't corgi. Even see it. Oh, it's, a it's an itty bitty corgi. It's a mini he's corgi. skinny. He's short too. He looks weird. I think he's a mix. 
Because he's got like... He's not the big fat style. He's not a hefty dufty one. Most of the ones are authentic. Shrimp etouffee. Ooh, that sounds good. It's spelled, I know how it's spelled, but that's how you say it. And that's, that's a, you know what, Jonathan, that's a great way to spell it so that people know what, how the hell to say it. What? Etouffee. What, what do you, what language is that? French. What does it mean? Well, it's a kind of like shrimp dish. All right, you guys need to go to the chat room somewhere. <laughs> this, is I a, bet. this is an English only channel. Nobody, well, we I like don't know it. what etouffee means. That's I, what the dish is called. Okay, I don't like it then. You would Because I can't it. pronounce it. You would love it. Shrimpy dimpy. Love it. Well, now that we all know that you're not allergic to seafood, I'm fish, digging into it, man. Dig into it! I'm all in. Before, he used to wonder if he was. Then he got tested. So what it is, is I'm allergic to bad shellfish. What do you mean? When I have shellfish and it's got that feeling, it's old and bad shellfish. That's when I get it. How it's do you not know? because I'm not allergic, but I still feel it. I'm like, if I'm feeling it, that's preservation of something. Polish food is good. I kind of want They're it today because my sister. Preserving their shellfish, and that's why I get a tickle. Karen posted a picture. My sister Karen posted a picture in Discord, which is for the Yo Club members. By the way, your sister Karen has tremendous seafood. She does, but she lives in Alaska. Tremendous seafood. I mean, she you lives want in Alaska fresh, off the damn ocean. You want ocean. fresh seafood? You gotta go to Seward, Hi, Alaska. Mark. They've got fresh seafood. You get tested damn. by eating seafood. No, he actually did have them test him to find out if he was allergic. But what it is is, I believe it's a preservative they use in the shellfish that gives me that tickle. That's very it's not the possible. shellfish. So they inject it with something. I don't know. Because the thing is, Joe, you never got sick eating sushi. Because you always were paranoid. Just like you were paranoid that Paranoia you were going to get sick on a, on a boat ride. Oh, yeah, that was dumb. And then he was paranoid. He was going to get sick on a boat ride. And so he took Dramamine. And then he did get sick because he, the took, bears. because he took the damn Dramamine. Hi, the man. Dramamine Manolo. Got him sick. Look at that beautiful sun, guys. I know. Wow, look at the color. Did you guys see the uh, color that's time. popping? It's Yo. perfect. Oh, look. It's look what building light. that is. What building is that? You don't see that very much. What building is that? This building, way down here is the Chrysler. That's a beautiful, beautiful building. Mm-hmm. What are they eating, a cookie? It's a purple, it's a- Where'd they get a, the cookie from? It's a zombie, it's um, in, in, insomnia, insomnia cookie? Insomnia cookie. Well, hell, you need a bag. The Chrysler is a beautiful Art Deco style building. I love that building. Your mom is allergic to MSG and Chinese food. I don't even, it's monosodium glutamate. Yeah. But it's isn't like that salt. just in all like almost seasonings, it, MSG? It's, it's a different kind of salt. Peel one pound of shrimp, one can of Campbell's mushroom season, all chopped onions, bell peppers, 30 minutes in a nut. Ooh, I wish I could have the rice. Maybe I'll put cauliflower rice in there, which is basically just cauliflower that's been riced. I don't ever do it myself because that's a damn mess. Just buy the bag. And then I wonder, is it going to really make that much more? Maybe it will. Maybe I'll do that. I know, drama mine for Josh, for Joe. Drama mean. He took some drama mean and he was drama all over the place. We're doing good, man. The traffic is light. I don't know. Five o'clock. I don't know. Look at all them dogs. They had like eight dogs he was walking. Look at how clean. Tell me about our Look at how favorite clean New York is. dishes. The windshield's clean. The car's Listen, washed. Jonathan, our favorite New York stuff is very simple food. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, my God. Look at the shine. Okay, when you pop that down. Look at the shine. Do you see that? We like very simple food. I mean, I like good food, but I don't want to have to pay like an arm and a leg for anything, let alone my dollars. See, Karina's allergic to shellfish. I know that. I know feeling. there are a lot of people that are allergic to shellfish. I know that feeling, but the doctor You literally gave me can the develop o an allergy. The doctor gave me the okay. You can develop an aller allergy to shellfish by eating too much. What? Yeah, if you overdo it. Let's not it. do that. Let's not do that. Well, I don't plan on eating like a dozen lobsters or something like that. Uh, we're not having a contest eating a dozen lobsters. This is Could not you imagine? A, I'd get sick of are you guys, wait, are you guys have a lot of seafood? What market is closest to you? Don't say it. Don't say it. I'm not going. 
fish bait market. It's not fish bait. It smells like it. It's Astoria Seafood has fish bait. quite a bunch. Fish bait. And basically what you do is when you go to Astoria Seafood, you go there, you can buy the seafood and take it home, or you can buy the seafood and hand it to them and tell them how you would like it prepared and they will cook it for you. I so would you like it cooked, sir, and not stinky. Joe loves hot dog stands. Oh yeah. Going to Little Poland on 2nd Avenue. No, we are going to Greenpoint. Brooklyn. We're going to Brooklyn. Heading off to Brooklyn. Because Romachek, I swear to God, I don't care what anybody says, I feel like Greenpoint has the most authentic Polish Ukrainian food there is. Greenpoint. I know everybody goes down to the Lower East Side. They go to Vasilka, which is Ukrainian. They go to Little Poland and stuff like that, which is I fine. Just walked in front of me. And just I was walk in front of a, a sir. Just walk in front of a car. I was rolling to a stop. I could have busted his femur. But we we love to go over to Greenpoint because you can go to the bakery. You can go to the sausage market. You can go to the. It's kind of like in a way. In a way. Like the Polish version of Arthur Avenue. Now, you need to explore the Polka Dot Street more often. That's the Polka Dot, Polka, Dot Polka Dot Deli thing is actually very good because they have a wait, lot of stuff. Is it? But that is, I think, Manhattan Boulevard or Manhattan Avenue. I can't, I think it side? is. Because there are two different sides of Greenpoint. I think it's Manhattan Avenue. Two different sides. Hi, Sunshine. But I know, those places here in Manhattan on the Lower East Side get talked up a lot. And I don't think Greenpoint does enough. Because, yeah, I know. It's over in Brooklyn. I get... What? What? Who's the hell is honking? That's $800, baby. Mm. That's a big horn. Lady, it's a little chilly for that skirt. I'm just saying. And Jonathan, there's only a couple of wind. gas stations on the island in Manhattan. I know where they are. And they're on the outskirts. You're so going like to in the pay middle. $625 for premium, guys. $625 You're going to pay a lot premium. of money. For your You're gas. gonna pay five fifty nine for regular. Peter Pan donuts are in Greenpoint. Yes, they are. That's a good spot, by the way. Joe's had them, and they, they put him are into crazy land. Good, but they give me carb coma. Motor City says he's good. He's lucky. He has no food allergies. Just dislikes and for the not good for you crap. Just made some mm -hmm. pretty good walleye cakes. Yeah, I've heard people like walleye. Walleye's cakes. big in Minnesota. It's huge. I don't like the name of it. And to me, I never understood the big great thing about on it. On Fridays, you have big walleye fish fries on Friday in Minnesota. They're big because the Great Lakes. Let me tell you. Have a lot every of time they go and go, oh, it's a walleye. I'm going to have the walleye. The walleye doesn't taste like anything but the bread. It tastes like perch. It just walleye tastes like Walleye is a big perch. That's all it is. Walleye is a supersized perch. It's the same thing. Same taste. It does taste like it's a good quality lake fish. They eat drink 99. But it's not like you're not eating bluegill or sunfish. That's disgusting. But I don't think there's a lot. I mean, people act like, oh, I'm going to have the walleye. I'm going to get so, oh, I'm it's such a wonderful thing. It's a Minnesota thing. thing. It's a Wisconsin thing. I just never thing. saw the big thing. I get it. And I'd be like, and? They are very stuck in that. Don't diss them. There's a lot of people in here that are from Minnesota and Wisconsin. I know that. I'm sorry for Angela. She's, she's, she's not being No, nice. I'm just saying I never understood the big payoff. It's part of their history. I get that. So Let is Ludafisk. That's disgusting. <laughs> That's a bad history. We don't want to relive that. Ludafisk is also part of their history. The Ludafisk, you can, when they start making it, you can smell it counties away. Uh, it smells so bad, you can smell it counties away. <laughs> carb coma. Yeah, we don't want a carb coma. But anyway... Let them have their history and their culture. I fully They're do, and proud. I think it tastes good. Well, it doesn't seem like you're saying that because now you're no, walking I it said, back. No, I'm not walking, walking anything. Back. Listen, I'm not walking anything back. I just We're said. Not walking it forward. I, think, I was wondering if those were squares. I think it tastes good. I just don't understand the big. See how she waffles? Props. Angela's a waffler. I'm a waffler. I'm not a waffler. You make a statement, you make a splash, then you don't stick to it. When I make a statement and splash, I'm sticking to it. Listen. You're going to waffle. It's an Ohio Great Lakes like thing. Perch waffle and walleye fish fries. Waffle. No, I get it. I lived in Michigan. Joseph, same thing. Walleye. Everybody's like, whoa, you get walleye? And when you went to Michigan or Wisconsin it's or any of those places. It's not in Michigan as in Wisconsin. And, uh, perch Minnesota. was a big thing. Everybody would get perch. Perch is big in Michigan. Perch. Perch is very big in Michigan. Yes. So, because it's Great Lakes, you know, all different lakes. But I'm telling you, it's 
walleye is big in Wisconsin and Minnesota purchased big in Michigan. Just yeah. Saying. That's what it is, guys. They we all go fishing there. and they have like, I don't know, they, but perch, you have to have like what, 12 perch? Perch, perch are smaller, yes. Perch is like, Walleye's you're eating minnows. big, big brother to perch, yeah. You're eating goldfish. Uh, that, you know, you talk about me exaggerating. <laughs> that is a massive exaggeration. <laughs> if I put a fish, like a perch in front of you, I put a, a well, minnow. You know, they or sometimes have like walleye fingers and stuff. You know, I, you're fine. worse than me when it comes to exaggeration. You really are. It's very mild water white fish. Yes, very similar to perch, sunfish, bluegill. Yes. Very it much so. It takes a flavor. It's like halibut. It takes a flavor of what you're cooking it in. Halibut... Is yeah, a very everybody mild loves. Fish too. Oh my God! Then Sunshine NYC just said something about halibut. Everybody loves halibut because it takes the flavor of what you're cooking it with. Yes, it takes the shrimp like, flavor, the when cheese we were flavor, in, the garlic flavor. When we went to Alaska, yes. my sister-in-laws in my sister's in-laws made taco halibut dish. It tasted great because it tastes like taco. It tasted like taco. If I closed my eyes, I wouldn't have known that it was fish. But it was like a very light meat. Because halibut's of a whatever. very light fish. It's big, but it's light. Karina mm -hmm. loves salmon. Well, I'm, stop, Karina. <laughs> I'm letting you out of the car. Salmon's got a distinctive taste. Salmon is very distinctive. I don't think walleye are more popular. I just think it depends on where you're fishing. That's what it is, Amber. Um, Roman check. I think it's because, like, if you're fishing in like Lake St. Clair, you're perch. not fishing Lake for Saint walleye. Clair, you're fishing for perch. Yes. And bluegill. Like here, like Superior looking or like, for walleye. Yes, Superior like Superior. Walleye. Lake Huron, Lake Mid all those or, bigger or lakes, it's walleye always or musky. walleye. Musky is the other big fish. Musky is the big prize fish. Muskies. Musky you don't lunch. eat muskies. I think people do eat musky. I think they're too bony. They're a big bony fish. But they're that's bony. A prize, they're like prehistoric. It's a prize fish. Yeah, fish tacos. No, fish tacos are good, but that's always almost like a halibut or something they use. Or a cod. Is that what they use? Cod? Cod is a popular but Because cod, it's very mild. Well, cod is an ocean fish. Yeah, well, so is halibut. Halibut's not halibut's in the lake. Halibut's a deep ocean, that's right. Halibut's the fish that swims fish. in the bottom and its eyes Walleyes go from two sides to one. Are freshwater lakes. Did you guys know that? That you got, oh, they're, they're driving on Angela's walkway. Up I don't like that. That's spooky. You don't like that, do you? No, I don't. The sun's wonderful, guys. The sun's wonderful. It's perfect time for Did sun. Did you guys ever see a cod? Not a cod. A halibut. Get your fish straight, Ange. No, because like, and I have these pictures from Alaska. I'm getting from kind of fishy over here with you. I'm and just fishy, saying. Fishy. So what? Fishy, fishy. But then they show up these big ones, these pictures of people go out halibut fishing in Alaska. 450 pound halibuts. Massive. Those are called barn doors. They're massive. They're called barn doors. Um, is that what they're actually called? During Lent we have fish. I know, everybody. We have fish fries in every restaurant. Yes. Almost all use yeah. fresh haddock. It's such haddock. a deep white flesh. Yes. Yes, haddock's, haddock's another, one. another one. Another cod and haddock are very similar. Yep. Yeah, I know. I mean, Who would have thought today fish. we're talking about fish and poop emojis? Oh, you know, Go fishing? Oh my fish God. Fish and poop? I am not. I might fish with a poop hat on. That's what I'll think. I'll do that. Fishing is very involved. Fishing takes a lot of skill and, and patience. Of which Joe, I have neither. <laughs> Joe has neither. Hi, Melanie. Lupe, I have Lupe. neither skill nor patience while fishing. He will. Cod is fresh water. I tried okay. fishing several places, even as a Boy Scout. I did get my fishing merit badge, barely. Barely. I actually catch more fish than you do. Absolutely, girl. I do. That's what's so funny. I can fish bluegill, sun. <laughs> I know. I remember I fishing with my sisters. Else. And then. Nanette had her line. We're in Alaska. She's fishing and she's totally, she's going to do it. She's got it all set up. Looks great. Throws her, oh no, connection. Are we back? Are we back? Because you're on the bridge. We're on the bridge, folks. In the traffic. Bridge in on traffic. The bridge in traffic. That signal on the bridge. <coughs> Everyone loves the fish from their own area. That's very true, Jonathan. Absolutely, Jonathan. That's it's correct. what they grew up with. Yes. It's what their childhood is. They believe in their, you know, traditions and stuff. I agree. Use haddock for dish 
and shit. Really? Really? Yeah. Sorry about that, because we're on the bridge. In certain spots, it kind of goes dead. Can't fix that. Can't fix it. But yeah, fishing's a lot of work. I don't know. Most people Treating just said something. I treating. What'd she say? I don't know. Joe, did you have a Zebco 202 reel? I don't know what the I number was. I had a Zebco. I don't know what the number was, but I remember having a Zebco. Did you? Yes, I do. The Zebco is the kind that it's has a, brand. a. Yeah. It's mostly bass, white perch, and brim. No, not sure. What what, not sure what brim is. What is brim? I don't know what brim is. What's brim? I don't know what brim. It's got to be a certain kind of fish. I don't know. Brim. Here we don't. We haven't gone fishing. Here they shoot for uh, what's it? That kind of uh, that's good. That's a seagoing bass, sea bass. They should go for sea bass. Oh yeah, sea you see them always huge. fishing along sea bass the Hudson. Is big. You see them fishing along the Hudson, yes. and then you'll see them fishing on the inlets. Yeah, you'll see them fishing in Coney Island too. Yes, you'll see them on the bridges there. and inlets because they want that. The sea bass is big here. Well, halibut's a very mild fish too. I don't care for sea bass. I've tried it. Not a big fan. It's more fishy tasting. Oh, oh yeah, definitely tastes like something in Chinatown. What? Stank, stanky. Going some stanky fish. Yeah, I haven't gone to a market yet in Chinatown that wasn't stanky. It almost smells as bad well, as the Well, the last store. time I was the down store there, stank too. Ugh, they God. had the fish in the bucket and they were pumping water in there, you like see, aerated I heard you say water. That. Uh, you said and the it's fish not doing are, so much. <laughs> that's not doing much. The fish are all belly they're up. All belly up, you said. They're I, upside down. I caught that in your live. I'm, I always <laughs> laughed to myself. <laughs> You're like, that's not doing I much. Of sunshine. Is that just a waste bubbles? I don't know. Because <laughs> them fish Doesn't are dead. make you think that they were floating around. Them with... fish are dead. I think the fish were getting moved around from the bubbles. <laughs> I heard that. And I was <laughs> laughing my little ass off on when I was watching the live. Oh, that I was, that was hilarious. You should have said it louder, though. Them fish ain't doing so good. Belly up in the bubbles. I looked down. I'm like, mm, I'm seeing the upside down part of the fish. Yeah, they'd be dead. I don't know why. Is it? It's, it's, is it the thing that's supposed to do? Tilapia is probably the worst bottom feel it, feeder. Oh, is it? I didn't know that. I know tilapia is very popular. But halibut's a bottom oh, feeder, too. that? That's the bridge shaking. Fuck, that was a lot. Yeah, that's the kind of vibration that that's I felt not a before. Good vibration. That's because I think the witch cult's going over it. Uh, subway. This is not a subway bridge. It's not? It's a big ass. It's a big ass truck. I didn't. I didn't like that. That did not make me feel good. Oh my god! I was over at Chow's in Soho recently. A nice place. I've never gone there. Oh, Chinatown in summer. Stank. On stanky. certain streets. On the fish market streets. Got to avoid the fish market streets, or you walk by real. They're fast. bad in the winter time. They're horrible in the summertime. I don't know why people like tilapia. I think people don't even know what the fish is. And then they go, oh, that sounds nice. And then they get it. Let's put a sauce on it. I didn't realize it. there's a fish called a dolphin. I thought they were eating dolphin, but they said no, it's dolphin. It's that big green fish. Green fish with a yellow fin on it. Yeah, it's called... Um, they call it a dolphin, though. It's mahi-mahi. Oh, a dolphin's a mahi-mahi. Same thing? Yeah, dolphin is mahi-mahi. I'm thinking, I thought they were actually eating dolphin. I'm like, can you eat dolphin? Hi, Enrique. No, they're eat not dolphin. eating dolphin. I didn't think you could eat dolphin. So it's like, then why the hell are we making the tuna net safe? <laughs> why don't we just You're catch them all? You need a dolphin. Just catch them. I need a dolphin. <laughs> yeah, and China's way of uh, going to war with us. Oh, yeah, it is. Did I spell that right? Oh, I don't even know. What did you say, sunshine? You're close enough. I got it. Monkfish, yeah. So monkfish, mahi, mahi, and tilapia are all the same fish? I don't know. I don't know about monkfish. I know it's called mahi mahi. Dolphin is also often called mahi mahi, says Ambrose. Is monkfish the same as that or is something monkfish different? I don't know what monkfish is. I wonder where that one got its name. But halibut's a bottom feeder. Halibut is a clean bottom feeder. Why do you say that? Because it's in Alaska. It's clean water up there. Uh, oh, okay. You don't, see any, you don't see any chemical factories up in Alaska. Yeah. 
no really that's what it is mahi mahi the fish is called dolphin but it's actually mahi mahi so that you you know that's what it's called oh i guarantee you they're not using sea bass they're probably yeah you're probably right they're using tilapia they'll use whatever cheap fish they can for cheap, 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 cheap. fish tacos i mean come on it's fish tacos. It's usually battered to batter it. That's right. To make it taste. You That's know, like good. if you have a good steak, you don't need to put a gravy on a good steak. The good steak speaks for itself. If they got it all gravied up, there's something there. Well, Melanie, on a, okay. So this is a crazy thing. Okay. So when a halibut is my poop hat's off because my head's hot. He's hot. When a halibut is born or whatever is new young whatever their eyes are on either side of their head did you know this no, I'm not and then they swim along the bottom and then the other eye moves to the other side of the head did you know that did you know that that their eyes are like this and then it moves to the other side because they swim along the bottom interesting isn't that crazy i think that's crazy I think it's for real. Yeah. I learned a lot when I was in Alaska. <laughs> I know you guys are all like, what? For real? <laughs> yeah. So when they put them up there on like the big display, when they catch the fish in Alaska, they put them all up there. They got the longitude and the latitude where you caught them all after you get off the boat. And they got all these fish. Sometimes there's a big one that's a halibut and that's the barn door size one they call it. And then the little ones are called chickens. Really? Yes, the little I halibuts did not know any of this. are called chickens and stuff. So like those are like the ones you eat. They're eating ones, basically. The barn door just hang up. And rock. what they show you is the bottom part of the fish because they're all white. You don't ever see the eyes. The eyes are on the other side of the fish, which are dark. That's why they're camouflaged. Because, you know, that's what it is. Spooky looking. I know. Oh my God, I forgot you guys are doing Polish food on Friday. That's funny. You're right. You're right, Treaton. Alaska ice fishing. They go out on boats, man. They go out on the boats. They go out to the bay. Yeah, they go out for real fishing. I don't do for real fishing. You like it breaded and fried with grits? Ooh, I liked grits too. I don't know. But you gotta have a lot of butter. I don't like that. You need butter and cheese. Butter and cheese. Salmon, wild salmon gets its color from the krill shrimp. Is that why? Tripe is the belly. Tripe is the intestines. The, actually, no, tripe is the lining. Just, it's the out. stomach lining. Stop. I'm going to toss my cookies. Right <laughs> That's what it is. Anytime you guys talk about tripe, Angela's eyes perk up because she's going to make me crap like that and then put me on film. I eat that. I don't eat. I don't. It's disgusting. I don't eat. It's like it's like a tentacle from an octopus. Intestines. That's what it looks like a tentacle. Everything is better with a little butter. That's what Julia said. We need more butter. Butter is wonderful. Jing Li. Jing Li. That looks like a tasty place. There's bubblegum, man. Man. I'm gonna get ideas from the restaurant you're going to. Um, kielbasa. You could make schnitzel, pork schnitzel, veal schnitzel. I prefer pork schnitzel. That would be delicious. He's got a blue hat on. He's got a hat on, but no coat. Dude, it's cold. Why are you being that way? 42 still. It's 42 damn degrees. With the wind. Julia Child. I love Julia Child. She would always, like, if she made a mistake, she didn't care. She just kept moving. She kept it moving. She's like, get along. Get along, little doggy. 
<laughs> Melanie Martin with a $5 super chat. Sorry, Thank Joe. You, Melanie. Didn't mean to get your gag reflex going with the tripe. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's only that Angel's going to try to make me eat tripe. That's Thank what it is. you, Melanie, and for I, the $5 super chat. If people bring it up, chat. that means I'm going to eat it soon because Angel's going to, oh, We're not Joel's going to make me tripe. It's going to be funny so I can throw up. Oh, my God. Hi, Village Boy. Welcome in. Welcome like in. Tripe. I didn't say we're getting tripe. Tripe doesn't like me. No, we're not getting it. We're going over to Greenpoint for some Polish food. Michelle King celebrates 12 months of membership. She Thank made it. You, yes, King. you made it a year. Thank you, Michelle King. Thank you so much for being a part of the Yo Club and hanging out with us in the it's clubhouse. Chaos. Chaos. Are we chaos? We are. I guess so. I was laughing that Kenny ordered pizza yesterday, but he ordered it from so far away. Like you guys, when you when you're in New York City, do yourself a favor. Do not order like you're staying at a hotel. Look for pizza places that are close to you. Even if it's three miles away, that is not close to you. Not in New York. Three language. miles away is across to Manhattan from Brooklyn. Yes. Three miles away could be it's in Brooklyn. From Manhattan. Yeah. That's a long way for, for the city. Yeah, so you can't order it. Like well, it that be, would be like it could be even Queens from. That could Brooklyn. be like I live in the Bronx, but I'm ordering it from you know downtown, which is crazy. There gotta be more pizza places locally. Yeah, there's usually like 20 pizza places from wherever you are, almost always, yeah. and one of them has to be decent. Yeah, you've got to order local. And regardless, because if the place says, oh, we're going to get it to you in 20 minutes, but they're three to four miles away, yo, cold. you ain't seen that food. And he didn't see the food for over two hours. It's going to be cold. I know. Doesn't matter how hot they put it in the box, it's going to be cold when it gets to you. That's <laughs> I know it took forever. He goes, but it was only three miles. I'm like, three miles? Three miles? Canny, baby. At Rush Hour? Are you kidding? Canny, baby. Canny, like, baby. Canny. I was like, yo, dude, I'm sorry, but way. you may never see your pizza. I could pick that pizza up and deliver it to you before they we get We could there. probably unbox the pizza and roll it down the street. It'll be so cold. Yes. Okay. <laughs> It'd be like a manhole cover. But he said it was good, which That's was good. nice. I'm glad he enjoyed it. That's good. And then he was actually very shocked at how large the pizza was. Because in New York, guys, big pies. you only get one size. Size is big. Oh, I'm so glad, Michelle. It's big size, big size. Yeah. This sun is fantastic. You feeling it, guys? You feeling that sun? It feels good. Yeah. That sun feels great. The sun is nice. Ooh, are we gonna make it? Are we gonna I'm make gonna, it? I'm gonna make it. Are we going to make it? As long as you're we in the car with We're me. gonna go across this the little, Pulaski this Bridge. This person here has to realize that she does not have a light. Thank no, you. she doesn't. She has her vest on, though. Like she she's a SWAT team member. Vest going on. She got her SWAT vest on. She does. For real. Going across the Pulaski Bridge, this will take us into... Not the Skyway, the bridge. This takes us from Queens Is to... Is this called the... No, it's not the Pulaski, Pulaski Bridge. Pulaski Bridge, not the Skyway Bridge. That was called the Kosciuszko Bridge. Kosciuszko's right there. Oh, we didn't go over across the Kosciuszko Bridge. Okay. Not off the Queensboro. Ah. Now there's like a new hotel they're putting up right there. I don't know what that is. It's a hotel. Are you sure? I don't know what that looks like. It looks like a building. I love how you're like, it looks like a hotel. 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 Joe, you're just making hotel. stuff up again. I know. Everything out here is Polish named. It is. Coming out here on Saturday, though, gets really busy. Doesn't it? It does. Hopefully they still have food. We shall find out. I know. I'll be very scared. Very sad if they have no food. And I can be scared. Not scared, but I'll be sad. Sad's different. I'll be like, what? You ain't got no food? Here, I'm going to put you guys. Actually, we're going to get you guys all set up. So this is a gas station. This is reasonably priced gas. Yeah, you can get gas out here. Hang on again. 349 for mid grade. No, sorry. Three. Whoops. Sorry, guys. 349 for mid grade. I just popped you that's out. That's cash price, guys. That's cash. Cash. You can add 10 cents or 20 cents you got cash? credit. Do you have transport? Do you have transport? That's Hang a on. Brooklyn price, by the way. 
Okay, hang on, guys. Here we go. Everybody, don't get sick. Going for a little spin. There you go. Boop. Boop. Okay. And then we take this down. I'll put that way away. Like, okay, now we are. Now we're here. Now we can refocus. Perfect. Grandma Joanne, how are you doing? Hello. Good to see you. Oh, that's right. They changed the left turn lanes up here. I can't oh, we got to watch out where we got to turn. I can't turn left up here. For away. real? I Why is this turn. unfocusing? Stop unfocusing. Oh, I know. The solar eclipse is happening on April 8th. Yeah, you can go see it up in Niagara Falls. We'll see a partial thing of it, but I don't know. Everybody else is going to see a full solar eclipse. Is it a solar eclipse or a lunar eclipse? It's usually a lunar. No, it's a solar eclipse. No, it's a solar eclipse. I think it's a solar eclipse, not a lunar one. But it's supposed to be able to be seen. I'm starving. We are having birria. Ooh, that's so good. I did get an invite up to Seneca. I don't know. I don't know. They said, come join us for this for the eclipse. I'm like, maybe. Maybe. Let's see if Josh wants to go see the eclipse. He'll probably be like, Mom. Like, come on, it's kind of cool. We have to wear special glasses. Oh, you're in Oklahoma? Yeah, there's a lot of places that are going to be able to see it as it swaths across the U.S. But in New York, it's going to be the northern. Oh, dang, he's moving. What's that carrying fuel? That's gasoline. I was. Um, the last one, I was working at Macy's at Herald Square when we had the last eclipse. And I went out with a friend and we had special glasses on and stuff and we went and saw it. It was actually very cool. They even told you how you could see it with your phone so that you didn't have to look at it directly. Because if you do look at the solar eclipse directly, guys, you will burn your retinas. Which is still crazy to me. Yeah, that's right. Like, how has that happened? It's on the UV. But I don't understand. Because if it blocks it and then it intensifies it? Yeah, but yeah. It's the edges that are bad. It's not the, it's the edges that are bad. Has anybody ever had that happen to them? I mean, you won't be blind forever, but you will have problems. Right? Isn't that what it is? Well, I mean, depending on how long I look at it, like an idiot. Well, I'm not going to look at it that long. I'm just wondering. You know? So Joe's got to take a backwards way to get there. You don't know either, Ray of Sunshine? I don't know. I don't know. I see we got 250 plus people in here. If you guys like these kind of streams in and around New York City, do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. That way you know when I go live. And you won't miss it. Next solar eclipse ain't until 2044. 20 years? 20 damn years? For real? They always keep saying the cicadas are going to come out. I remember the last eclipse, the birds were confused. Really? They're going to close your Macy's in San Francisco? It's been there for 100 years. I know they're doing a ton of that. Ooh, hey there. Hey there, El, is it El Pepper, 1964? We can go to Bakestone if you want to go to Bakestone first and go see what they have, unless you want to go to Polka Dot. But we want to go here. We want to go here. I mean, here, Polka Dot's another freaking sign. Why would you do yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, we're going to go here. This has got, you, you can't park here. That? Why would you even say that? Polka Hi, Bradley Jones. I know. I all the time. I don't know where you are. I don't know where you are. I don't know where you are. Is that a parking right there or no? No, it's not. Parking. No. That's parking. That's parking. No parking. Shit. No, park. no park. No parking in front of the 
No parking, 8 a.m. to 4, 4 p.m., Joe. You could have parked there. Where does it say that? On the sign, to 4 p.m. Are you sure about that, Angela? This is your ticket if I park here. This is your ticket. You can't park in front of the drive. It's a whole thing's a drive. You This got the sign has an arrow that points behind, but you're going to park behind that car. I'm parking right here. No, you can't park here. This is a driveway. The sign says okay. No, it doesn't. After the driveway. Behind the guy that was behind us. Where I thought you were pulling into. You can't park in front of a parking driveway. Oh my God, you guys. You are. Honestly, we're in a perfect place. We're, you're being totally Polish right now. You can't park in front of a driveway, Joe. It's a driveway. Is that a garage? That looks like a garage to me, doesn't it? It's got the slanted thing. Guys, is that a I I don't know. Can you park there? <laughs> Can you park there, guys? You know, you, you know, you're such an idiot. You pissed me off because I How am I an idiot? You. you can park there. I get there. You can't park there. That's what you said to me. You can park there. I back up. You can't park there. I thought like, you were parking on the corner. On the goddamn corner? Oh, you're such a corn cob right now. You oh, are absolutely corn cob. Wait, am I this? You're a fucking poop emoji all over the place. <laughs> am I this? I can't. I can't You can't. I can't with you're him. Complete corn cob. <laughs> you know what you are? You're corn in the poop. That's what you are right now. You're the poop corn. You're poop corn. Am I poop head? You're poop corn. Joe? That's too far away. We can find something. We can find something else now. Yeah, poop corn head. My name is Angela. I'm the, I'm the corn kernels in the Joe, poo. I don't know. Am my head in the way? I'm the corn kernels in the poo. Yeah, you got a pretty big hat right there. Come on, Joe. My name is Angela. I'm the poop He was going to park in front of a driveway. Did you see that? What was that? That was poop. You pooped on me. I did not. What was that? Somebody threw poo at me. Joe's Who said. threw poo? Who threw poo? I don't know. He doesn't want to bother us because, you know, poop emoji person in the car. Freaking him out, scare him. Who flew poo? Who flew poo? That's a spot. This is a spot. You want to walk that far? No, we can find a better one. Oh, you're the one answering your own questions. Who flew flung poo? That's a hydrant. Bro. That's a hydrant. Okay, closer. I know. We all know Joe's hot button. Who flung poo? We all know Joe's hot button. He's like, I'm going to park here. I'm like, I don't know. Can you think you can park here, Joe, with a giant painted sign that says no parking? That's a driveway. No, he did not have any St. Joseph pastries. Because they're not low carb. Fafa wants the poop hat. <laughs> Timu, baby. Timu, baby. I'm going to drop you off. They're open. I'm going to go. Um, like, oh, are you afraid of the poop hat? That's for you. Oh, no. Let's see how that works. We need to get a pony up. You don't want to do it. Listen, I'm going to do it when I need to do you it. You a pony up. You don't want to do it. I, I literally. But we're going to eat. What about They're going to be closed by the time you get out. Look what time they close. You got 20 minutes oh to go there. God. You never can Okay, get there. we're going in, guys. We're going in. We're going in deep. My card? <laughs> My card. Oh, the other card? Okay. All right. We gotta see if we can get in here and see if I can get any food. Park Deli. This is where we go and get like hot dogs and stuff like that. Let's go see. Oh, no, they closed already. Joe, Joe. They closed. They closed early. They decided we got no big, we got no people. They had 20 minutes and they told me no sale. No sale to you. What the hell? No sale. I don't even have my hat on. You're committed. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm committed. All right, I'm going. I'm going, guys. This is Greenpoint. Got pierogies here. Look at all that stuff. I know they closed early, guys. They closed early on me. For real. Why is that? Um. Now I gotta find out where Joe is. 
Now, one of the places we like to go to is Crajan, but that's, I thought down over there. I can't remember. I know. Oh, crap, right? <laughs> oh, crap. That's a good one. That's a good one, guys. That was the one place I did not check to see if they were going to be open late. Everybody else should be open till like 8 o'clock. They closed! Oh, would that be the spot? That I that spot's good? Yeah. You sure? Yes. How do you know? That's the spot I told you to park in. Yeah, I'm there. Isn't that a pretty car? Look how beautiful that car is. It's a beautiful car, but Zoom you see? in that car. Come on, that car's beautiful. Oh my God. Look at that car. Crayon. Isn't that the place we get the, the meat from? Let's go get some food. Oh, okay. All right, see? He parked exactly where. Let's the bars in here first. We don't have them anymore. They're not in there anymore. I've looked in there. Oh, I brought my hat. I gotta get my hat. Oh, yeah, you gotta go get the hat. Hurry up. Oh, Joe's stopping traffic. <laughs> He's so ridiculous. Yeah, he parked exactly where I told him to park. How funny is that? His head's cold, guys. His head's cold. He forgot his ball cap. He's probably going to cause somebody to have an accident. Oh, is he coming to this corner? Is he coming to the corner? <laughs> My head's so cold. Not it's anymore. So it's so much better now. Okay, come on. Come on. Let's get some food. I'm starving. <laughs> Something on my head? Good job. What are you going to do with the old? <laughs> guys okay what are we gonna eat what are we gonna eat guys hey there let's see what they got do you want oh they do have a oh is that fish that's fish you don't want fish they have a couple pieces I think that's chicken or pork Oh, you know what? They are. I didn't even realize that. Oh, look, you guys got charged too. Did you not? It's right there. Where? Oh. Hi there. Do you guys have, um, is that dill pickle? No, that's, uh, Oh, split pea. Oh, no. I can't have that. Oh, pickles on Fridays. Oh, man. Do you guys, uh, is that pork or chicken up here? The... Chicken but pork is fine. Oh, okay. Do you want chicken or pork, Joe? Pork. Oh. Yeah, can we get two things of pork? Pork, pork, pork to stay? Yes, to stay. Okay. And then um, some of this, uh, this, this up here. That'd be perfect. And then this? Yes. Do you want any burgers, John? Anything else? You want coffee? You want coffee? Okay. And then um, coffee, and then I'm going to get a soda. I have some. Oh, where's? Oh, there's your cucumbers up here. You guys moved it all. Yeah, I don't have cucumbers. Oh, you don't have any? Okay, because I can't see. Well, that's fine. Then that's fine. What you got right there? Cucumbers, guys. We're towards the end of the day. Okay. He wants a hot coffee. Small or large? Large, please. Hang on a minute, guys. Let's flip you around. Okay. Um, what do you want your coffee? You just want it with cream, right? Just cream. I got a soda here. Okay, ready? Okay. 
total, $26.55. Just so you guys know. Thank you. Do we have, no, we don't have napkins out there. Okay, we gotta grab some napkins. Grab another. Okay. Grab that. Hey, Joe, come here and grab some stuff. Oh, you did grab it all. I swear. I swear to God. Boop. This will be like a little snack. Okay. I know we are. I had to take my hat off because it gets too hot. Yeah, you're getting too hot. My hat gets really hot. Okay, okay. there you go. Okay, so we got like the pork and then kind of like beagles, right? So it's sauerkraut and it's got kielbasa. Mm. It's like beagles. It is. You gonna get a horseradish? No. Did you want some? I don't know what it is anymore. It okay. changed everything. It's all different. It is. It's all different. It's done like um the price here though for both of these. For both things plus the coffee was twenty six dollars. I'm gonna tell you guys, if you guys were to go to the silk up it would be $26 for one. No lie. Right? I gotta get strong. That's what I could do. I would love to get probed, but I can't. They're so good here. When she did anything that she shot. What? You didn't eat nothing yet. You're shy. I did. I had a couple bites. Did you? Mm -hmm. And this is like a family-owned little place. It's really small. Oh, no. It's on the corner of Nassau and Humboldt. Very popular. And that's why we like coming here. Very popular. This used to be called... What was it called? North Something Bakery. I thought it was, no, I don't know, no, it's something. But now it's called Bake Stone. Okay, for low, I have only two. That's really good, though. Okay. Right? And you can get the stuff to take home. And half of the, I usually will come in here before the holidays and buy a ton of stuff. They usually have, they usually have a sausage up there. Kawasa, mm -hmm. kawasa, kawasa. Tony, it's really good. You have to, you guys want good Polish food. For real, you gotta come down to Greenpoint. There's restaurants. There's little tiny delis, there's places like this. A lot of them will serve the hot food. Now that one place was closed early. Closed to them? The sign said till six. So I had 20 minutes, but I think they probably were just like. Now, that place changed owners too. But that's where we used to go get the big, huge thing of sausage. Yes. Which, you're welcome, Tony. Which is like, if you guys go back in our videos. COVID. Mm, I'm gonna show you. This has got the sauerkraut, the carrot, and then the sausage. Mm. Nice, it is. It was really good. Really good. I strongly recommend this place. Yeah, definitely keeping it local. It's one of our, it's one of our uh, Greenpoint hangouts. I mean, come on. That's a huge, it's huge, right? That's right, oh. No, they have now a shiki up there. 
They have ribs, they have chicken, they have pierogies fresh up there. Treaton says, Coffee Joe, kibasa at our house for Fafo Friday. That sounds good, right? I mean, I can split this with you. We don't share. We're not sharing. But they actually make the dill pickle soup. Right? Friday. Friday, they make the dill pickle soup. Dill pickle soup is very good. And, oh. There you go. The dill pickle soup is good. Wow. If you guys can make dill pickle soup, oh my god. It's so good. And it's actually really easy. Thank you, Rhonda. Thank you, Rhonda. We used to have Checkpoint here in Redondo Beach. What's Checkpoint? Uh -huh. Putting on. See, they box it up. And they even have the Polish chicken noodle soup, which is with the tiny little noodles. The tiny noodles. It's good. Right? That looks good. It's not like when you get your soup and it's like 10 noodles floating around. That's like full. They're thinking of, wait, scroll that down just a little bit. I said just a little. Okay, scroll back up, don't be dumb. Okay, more. All right, Rhonda, let me see, check. New York State, is it said New York State, what does that say? What state is thinking about lowing gas grills? You, I want to see that. That's the comment I was looking at. Hmm. From everywhere? Fafo? That's pretty crazy, Fafo. Like everywhere? That's pretty crazy. How are they going to outlaw that, Fafo? Uh, that seems like a tall order. Maybe in, maybe in there. Yeah. Polka and um, Eagle Rock, only mom and pop left. Really? Hi, Rio Jones. I think it'd be very hard to do, considering that would totally eliminate everybody's propane tanks. How do you regulate that? So you're going to ban the sale of propane grills in the state of New York? Wow. And what's the Does difference that mean, between that? Charcoal's okay? Or all, I mean, what? Is natural gas grills okay, or what, what are we talking about? What about a propane, like, stove? What about your propane tanks? Yeah. On, on your house? Hi, Misty. Deanne. Because propane tanks are, Squeeze in, when you get further away from the city, are more common. Especially, yeah, on you're your out home, there. On your home appliance. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, and what is the purpose? Okay, let's talk about it. What's the purpose? What do we say? Follow the money. Follow the money. Follow the money. So everybody's going to use charcoal? Who's brothers in the charcoal business? Mm -hmm. Or the firewood business? Isn't that more useless though? Wasteful? Right? Those are good questions. Electric stoves? We got gas. I don't care for electric stoves myself. I hate cooking on electric stoves. I mean, I know it's a thing. Like we had to do it when we were in the, in the van. Not, it does cook different. It, does, it cooks differently, it guys. Cooks, it doesn't cook the same. Control, it's true. You're used to cooking an electric stove, I guess you're okay with it. But from somebody cooks House is exploding, Jonathan, I get that, but you know what? The reason why the houses are exploding Wait. is because of the meth labs. 
Let's get want, serious. They don't want to talk about that. Let's get serious. They don't want to talk about that. They're not exploding that. because people have a gas grill or have a gas stove. Or else we'd have houses exploding all over the place. We don't. Now, there have been some gas leak explosions, Angela. Yeah, because buildings don't want to update their gas. Like, ours had to get updated. Right. Right. So there have been gas leak explosions. You have to accept that. Yes, and there could be an electric. So why don't they do it every single time when we have Christmas that nobody has electrical lights on anything? We can't have electricity because we might burn our place down because we're wiring up a whole tree. Yours is always better. It's exactly the same Mine thing. Mine good, hers is better. It's literally the exact same thing, Joe. Yours has got so much more protein. There's what are you so talking much, about? more chunks in yours. Mine was not chunky. I don't think you pay attention to your food. I think you're right, pay attention to your food. I think you pay attention so much to everybody else's food. There's some truth here. <laughs> George is way better. So, because you always want to hurry up and finish your food to get to the other person's food. Word. I know. I guess those are for the car now. I feel bad that I took them and touched them. Whoop, almost spilled my soda. He's going to go back. He's going to help it. You take the nap and you touch this. I touched that too. You didn't touch these. Are well, good. just put them in the car. We need them. Take them. No, you're not. I'm a retired Enviro safety pro. In Manhattan, they are making coal fired pizza places to get special device for emissions control at the owner's exchange. Oh, really? Well, I kind of understand that as long as that they have mm -hmm. venting because places here. Are usually enclosed and do they have proper venting outside because it's like when you have a pizza place it's not like a standalone one-story thing it's, attached to it's usually attached to maybe a brownstone or something like that that's got like six floors above them me. all right go ahead go ahead mr. poop emoji your dryer's electric It'll be safe with electric fireplaces. We don't even have a fireplace. We don't. Okay. I guess he's telling me we're going. Okay. Joe, do you need to use the bathroom? Sure. Do you like how I asked that? And he's like, I should probably go. It is going to be expensive. You know what? Let him get rid of it. Let him get rid of the gas stove. Wait, no, don't get rid of the gas stove. Gas stove, I don't pay for it. The electric, I pay for it. They won't let you join the Boy Scouts? <laughs> Hi, Claire. I'm waiting for Joe now. He's going to want my soda. I know it. Hi, Patrick NY, how are you doing? You have an on electric house. Is it expensive though? I would think it would be. But gas doesn't bother me. For real. Because people bring in those heaters and plug them in. What about all those electric heaters that people are putting into their apartments and then they're burning part in the building down? It's the same thing. No matter what you do, you're going to have problems. The vowel at the end of a name allowed. <laughs> Donating to good health. I think it's crazy. I think it's crazy. One more rule, one more law to so-called make us safe. Okay. They're really cleaning that whole thing. The name of this restaurant is called Bakestone. 
Your sister's house is all electric. It was built a year ago. The thing is, if it's all electric, the problem is when the electricity goes out, guess what? You don't even have a, the gas stove to heat your thing from. I will tell you, when we were in Michigan, it's called the Bakestone. Bakestone Bakery. Oh, that's crazy. 170 pounds? That's nuts. I know, Treat, you guys just bought a new gas stove. You're not giving it up. <laughs> Listen, when we were in Minnesota and a storm took out our power grid for our area, I'm going to run the bathroom too. Here. Oh boy, talk to everybody. Hey guys, we're good to go. We're gonna try polka dot next. Wow, look at that. Solar panels, ah, crazy. Solar panels, I can't get solar panels on a Jeep. That's true, Rhonda, space heaters are very dangerous. They can be very dangerous, that's very true. Especially the ones that have the propane on them, or kerosene. Exactly, treat 99.7. Yes, always follow the money. It's people don't just make these decisions based on who oh, it's a good idea. Follow the money, follow the families. Who's gonna get what? Who's not gonna get something? It's always for somebody and against somebody else. Yeah, I do like outdoor wood stoves, by the way. I do I like outdoor wood stoves. I like those. I like the smell of the wood. But that's me. It's I like that. Uh, dessert. Good question. Uh, probably gonna have a polka dot. See what we can find. Thanks, Adrian. I love your support. You're the best. Oh, really? I still have that portable fireplace here in Sunday for Christmas. I still have it in the car. I have to burn that thing. But I gotta do it um, safely. I don't know why I'll have to do that. Maybe I'll go to Bopples and run it. Stomach of steel! I do not have a stomach of steel. I, I have a very weak stomach, I think. Wow, Jonathan, that's awesome. Two bucks a month. Damn, that's, that's really cheap. Ours is more expensive than that. We, we just have very limited power because we just came off of um, all the gas is paid for by the landlord. We just have to pay for electricity. That's nice. We don't have to pay for water or gas. Hi, Griffin66. Ready? He's so crazy. Thanks. They are open till 8 p.m. Very close. Okay. We go down the ramp. It keeps my head warm. It does keep your head warm, right? Very warm. Okay. I'm going to go over to, what do you call it? Polka Dot? Yeah, we got to drive to Okay. We got to drive to Polka Dot. There's a lot of good places down here. Oh my God, I thought you were a stranger because I didn't realize you had the damn hat on. I am a stranger. I was like, what is going on? I thought it was a crazy person. That used to be the busy bee, right? It's gone. using the saw she was actually vacuuming or sucking up all the water out of the cooler so that she could have completely cleaned 15 cents every three days on e-bike what your car is super clean joe super duper clean Hey, if you want me to, here, I'll switch out. 
You gave me my car. My coffee shoe. Well, that's empty. Empty. Put that in here. Here's my coffee cup. Empty. Put, put this one in there. Okay, put that one in here. Which... Oh my god, I gotta get in the car before he shuts the door on me. Yo. I know. Right? The ex wife has a van for the kids. Ooh. Right, I know. He's got the damn poop emoji hat on because his head's cold. You know, that's what happens when you're bald. Poor little Jojo. He got chilly and he forgot his ball cap. So that's what he gets to wear. <laughs> nice and toasty inside? Okay. I know it is very warm. I mean, you know. It does its job, right? I forgot Your my fuel hat. bill on e bike, $2 a month. That's what he said, yeah. What does that mean? His fuel bill is $2 a month. It's really cheap. Oh, because he takes the e bike? And he gets all his fuel bills. He has no car, it's just fuel for his bike. Oh, for his well, e -bike, we need a whatever. car. I would have to bike a lot. And if I was to use an e-bike, my fuel would be like a lot of money. I would have to keep charging it. Oh, but you have your own e-bike. Yes. You know what you had to initially invest in that. Get a real one, like a nice one. It's Those pretty spendy. Those are not cheap. Those e-bikes are not cheap. Nope. Initial They're investment spendy. in an e-bike is quite expensive. A proper one, not like one from... dollars Yeah, they're like 1500 bucks. Are they really around? They can be, Yes. This is Joe right. does love his Polish food, guys. This is really does. This is I don't know. I can't see behind me. I don't have eyes in the back of my head. You're not a helmet? No. Okay. You're confusing this person really bad. Yeah, it's a new car. Okay. Joe's car is clean. He can't handle it. He just keeps staring at the shininess of it. He's very distracted. Distracted driving. What are you distracted with? The shininess of my car. Shine at the of the hood, the shine, I haven't seen shine. it cleaned in ages, and this is new to me. I feel like I'm driving a new car. I am driving a new Jeep. <laughs> I know, DC. He loves his Polish food, despite his poopy hat. So hey, mermaid. To, um, polka dot. It's on the yeah. It's on the other side. I know it is. I just found the location. Welcome to me. Polka dot. It should pop right up. Polka dot dot. dot. Mm -hmm. 726 Manhattan. Just, well, it says walk, but we need drive. Okay. Oh, I guess I have to do this, and then I have to do this. Let's say go. Go. There you go. You see a are we on Norman Avenue? I am. Okay, well, we go straight on that. It's shiny. I know, he gets very distracted with it. I know, we're on the road again. I'm kind of full, though. But we'll get stuff to take home. We'll see what they have. There was Jonas Dim to be tappy things. I don't know why you do that. Why do you do that? Comfort. I don't understand that. Comfort. It's a comfort thing. Has our vehicle ever been hit during yes. the night because we park yes. on the street? Yes, yes, it has. It was actually hit by a drunk driver. Yes. It was hit on a uh, Sunday. It was hit on a Sunday. We went out to the car. The car was torn up. Five cars were torn up. This guy Actually, plowed, this guy plowed up this, a whole bunch of cars. This drunk driver plowed But five that cars. could happen to anybody parking anywhere in anywhere. You could have been there. I could have been I've parked seen for a bar. On YouTube where cars are getting plowed in their driveway and cutting up their lawn. So it's not like it doesn't happen. Guys. It doesn't. Yeah, it happens. It happens. It could, if it's going to happen, it's going to happen. Drunk drivers are drunk drivers. Hi, Jose Miguel from Isla Magadita. They are just drunk drivers. And every city has does. drunk drivers. And then it took us forever to get the police report proper because they were waiting on one person to come in and fill out their information. And we kept asking for the police report. Guess who that person was? The guy going in to fill out the police report. The guy looking for the police report. It was Joe. They wouldn't let They're like, we can't find the last person. I'm like, it's us. <laughs> that was that was truly a New York moment. It's me. I've been walking in here every single day for the past four days. 
What can you not find? That was weird. Thank you so, I Rhonda. I didn't understand that at all. But you hadn't given them any information from you. You might have said your name, but they didn't know. They were looking for the plate number. I think is what it was. They thought that they were still looking for that person. I don't know. It was bizarre. I like I said, it was weird. It was very weird. Okay, next street, we turn right, and Polka Dot is on the right-hand side. Gator. That place is called Gator? Gator. This is a hydrant? Uh-uh. No. That guy's backing up, though. I don't know where the hell he's been. Is he backing up into a thing? What is he? No, he just. Oh, these two fuckers. Are these two games. people are playing games. I can't. Why are these you doing that? Are that guy's parking in a. Oh, he's parking in a spot. And this guy's taking together, a hydrant. That's a spot right here. That was the spot behind us. Oh, okay. I'm going to play with the fucker parade. Oh. What parade? Quacker parade. What? Quack. Did you just say? Quack and a quack. Joseph, you're quack, swearing. Quack, 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 quack. Don't be swearing like that. All right, where's Polka Dot? There it is. So Doo -doo. This is paid parking. Well, that's what's going to happen. Oh, my God. Joe. Polka Dot's right there. There's Polka Dot. I can't see some of the posts. Excuse my language. I know. That little hard thing just hit it. <laughs> I wish you could make it go away. You can't make it go away. It likes to hang out there. Right there. And across the street is the Peter Pan Donut and, and Pastry Shop. all the are gone. Are they really gone, though? Mm -hmm. Do we really think they're gone? Yes, I do. Okay. What's What number are we at? I can't read it. A three one zero. Oh. I can't. I can't read it. I can't read backwards. This is I can't read backwards, guys. Peter Pan has no more donuts. I, you'd think there'd be a lot of donuts in there. Maybe they only know how much to make. I'm kind of looking for sausage to take home and stuff. I think that's what I'm looking for. Joe's, Joe's doing high math over here. All set. Okay, done, 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 done. Do you need to do the, the thing and the thing? The thing with the place and the thing? Yeah, we'll I don't know what that, I don't know, but you gotta find out if you have to pay. Of course you gotta pay. Well, maybe you don't. The, last time I what? the other one was after four. Or is it just something more grow? I can't read the sign. 7 p.m. I think it says. You have to pay Paul. Okay. He's getting the parking app up. It is. You want me to read it to you? 310-842. You like the thumbnail for the live? <laughs> Carrie. Three ton, East three, Manhattan Avenue. Yeah, 310 842. Okay, so there we are. Mm -hmm. That's where we are. We don't need that much time. We need an hour? You can give it, give it an hour, I guess. We're not going to be here that long. Do a dollar. A dollar. A whole dollar. I wish it was drunks or why we can't have nice things in you know I see that's true Dollar twenty, boo -boo. okay we got it parked in oh look we got Massachusetts in front of us the spirit of America Boop. spirit of America okay. it is chilly There's no don't. Oh, there's donuts in there. Do you want to go grab? Should we grab some donuts for Josh? Yeah, let's do. I need a big fat juicy kibasa too right now. Christian says. Oh my god. You too cold? My head's cold. Okay. Are we want? Do we want to go get donuts or no? 
Now, does Josh want them? Um, I don't know. Probably not. These are open. They're open till 8.30. Oh, damn, it's steamy inside. It's warm. Ooh. Oh, they have that? That's Hello. Good. How are you? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Thank you for noticing. <laughs> it's she the best. said I wouldn't wear it in, and I'm wearing it. I've been now. daring him to wear it everywhere today. My head is very cold. <laughs> it's perfect, right? See, she's with me. My head's cold. I know. Oh, they have dry, spicy cabanossi and then regular cabanossi. Regular. Can okay. Some of this for eating here? Do you need to? I'm not hungry anymore. Mm -hmm. Well, if you want it, we can get it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, why don't we get... We're sitting down, right? Yeah, I guess so. But I'm going to get a few things. Okay, we're going to get the dry cabanossi and some spicy. You want what? Oh, my God. All right, get that. Get Josh some pierogies. Pierogies are here. Some Josh pierogies. Josh. Get Josh some pierogies. Potato is sauerkraut. He likes nope. potato. Cheese. Cheese and potato. There you go. Good That's 18. 18 He's more. not going to eat that much, though. Well, maybe I will get it. I'll get the ones up here. Get yeah, I'll get them up here. Because he'll only want like six. Hey there. She's going to pay for it. Oh my God. Okay. Yes. Can I get um, three of the dry spicy cabanossi and then six of the regular dry cabanossi? The little ones to go. Yeah. Three and then six of the other. Yeah. I think we can tell. <laughs> Yeah, those are to go. Um, I'm gonna get uh, yeah potato and cheese. If I can get six potato and cheese pierogies to go, and then what did you want, Joe? Oh um, yeah, he wants one of the sausage here for here. You need more. You need more kraut. I'm in danger. Yes, those are to go. The potato and cheese pierogies are to go. So look, they have the chicken. Oh, look at that. Chicken meatballs and dill sauce. That looks delicious. He wants the sausage here with some of the, um, is that Vigos? The, the sauerkraut here? Meat. I don't be doing vegan. Vegan? What is that? I know. And then... Yeah. We'll just pick up this plate together. Want to give Josh some cake? That's good. Do I want to get him some cake? To the right. Right, to the right, to the right. All right, all right. Um, I don't know. What else do you want to get him? Oh, that up there. Oh, they do have cheesecake, honey cake. Cheesecake also has a layer of poppy seed. Right, that's the poppy seed one. Um, you know what? Let's do a slice of the honey lemon cake to go, and that's it. Yeah. Do you guys by chance have dill pickle soup? Yes, we have all of our soups in the fridge. At the end, the pickle oh. soup's on the right side. If you want it warmed up, you can hand it over to okay. me and I'll warm it up for you. No, we don't want it warmed up. I was just wondering if they could carry it. So guys, this place is called Polka Dot. It's over on Manhattan Avenue, over in Greenpoint, like I've been saying. For later. <laughs> So I'm going to tell you guys in a minute. Hang on. Sauerkraut is so good for you. It's a probiotic, I guess. It's just something that we like. The Migos. 
When we make it though, it's like super rich. New York cheese. All right, so we got the cabernet soup, here are these beagles, sausage, chicken, meatballs, and honey. Yeah, honey lemon. Okay. Honey lemon. Just one slice. Yes. Right. To go. To go. Something to drink. Oh wait, what did you? Well, his soda. Okay. All right. Yep. Hey, Mr. Adam's apple. How are you? Okay, great. Should I pack everything else into a bag? Yes, everything that's to go in a bag. Thank you. And guys, I'm gonna tip her this way. That way I know she's getting the money. Mm -hmm. Oh, they do have borscht. I'm sure they do. Oh, yes. We have vegan, meat. They have vegan regular. and meat and regular. Here, I'll show you. This is fry, barley. Let's cook, Nick. That's the chicken noodle I was speaking of, guys. I don't do split pea, as y'all know. Um, polka dot. Oh, that's the vegan pickle. No, no, I like the pickle with like nothing in it. They actually have other stuff in it. Mushroom soup. I like to make my pickle soup. They usually put, um, what do you call it, in it? Potatoes. Okay. Hi, we got my best friends with me. Very comfortable, by the way. Very comfortable. Thoughtful. We need one of these thoughtful. Very nice. Keep your head warm. Keep your head warm, Papa. <laughs> What's going on in the chat? Cash tip always. Exactly. Is this our It is. I was about to bring it over to here. Thank you so much. Oh, do you need an extra plate? No, we're going to have the same plate. She's stuck with me. I am. I'm stuck. Okay, here's our stuff. Chair. Okay. Gonna fill health inspection? What? what? It's got an A. It has an A, guys. <laughs> well, who would said that? Uh, Ambrose. Ambrose. The chamber pot! No, it has an A, guys. Okay. So there's this Bigos sausage. Those are chicken meatballs. Sour cream. And he wanted sour cream. Dill pickle soup is so good. Trust me, it is. It's really good. Okay, I wanted to taste these chicken meatballs. I know, right? Is this kibasa? That's good. Mm. It's super hot. Pablo's Kitchen has great pending. Oh. <laughs> it better now. Yes, I have one. It's not good, Pablo. Oh, well, yeah, Which one do you like better for the Beagles? Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to find it. Okay. <laughs> I'll tell you. Why? Okay. I like this one. This one. Flavor. No, this one has big pieces of pork in it. Uh-uh. Oh. This is good. Hot. Yeah. Oh, go ahead. I'm gonna wait a little bit to my skull. Fancy, 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 fancy. Day night. Day night. 
You know what Joe's excited about date night? I get to eat. It's perpetual eating. He likes to can eat. Can eat. Angela can't complain because we're live. I can always eat while we're live. You're so ridiculous. I like their bagels. Like I said, when I make mine, it's really meaty. It's very meaty. It also has mushrooms. Oh, okay, so that's because it's yours. Okay. Mm-hmm. You got really good bagels. My bagels is fabulous. Yeah, the other one is North, um, um, Big Stone. Mine's is good. That's because I have to let it cook. Let me taste the sausage. <laughs> Fafa's getting the payoff envelope. <clears throat> now, normally, normally for my sausage, my kibasa. Kibasa. Treating kitchen today plus. Oh my gosh. Nice treating. Somebody was saying you had a bad health rating. I don't know who said that. That's good. <laughs> I love how they're trying to make it something else. The so but I usually like to have horseradish with my sausage. You ask. Mm -mm. Around He's alive. Poop. Joe is alive. I'm walking around with a poop head. You can't ask for horseradish. Well, I didn't want it. I wanted to taste their sausage and not the horseradish. Horseradish is so powerful. It's powerful. Joe, you don't like it. It's very powerful. You don't like it. Are you getting any of this meat here? Are you tasting that? I think that's the part that you're missing. Mm -hmm. I felt it. It felt in my pants and it was hot. Your new house is coming together. We finally feel like we belong here now. Oh my God. Thank goodness. Doesn't that take forever? Do you like the chicken meatballs? They're okay. Joe, okay, close your eyes and then eat it. It can be pork, kibasa, and beef. That's how I make it. I have three different the kinds colors of colors off on that meatball. <coughs> it's chicken. Off. It's chicken. Dung dung. Dupa head. Don't be a dupa. This is a dupa head, I'll show you. It's a chicken in a dill sauce. That's too bad. Yeah, so what's in Bigos is pork, sometimes um, pork, kibasa, and beef. This keeps so very warm. It's like hot, it's hot steamy too. I can't with you. Let me have some drink. Mm -hmm. Why do they put these things in It's bay leaf. Actually, that's not available. It's something else. It's another kind of belief. <laughs> foliage. It's foliage. It's greenery. It's herbaceous. It's herbaceous. Delicious. Do you like it? Yeah, we have some sausage for home. Pierogies for Josh and cake for Josh. Who's going to put Yours. <laughs> I'm saving all my money, putting it under a rock. Joe cannot say he's hungry today. He ate so much. I'm going to go home for sleepy time. I know. You are going to go home for sleepy time. Anyway, guys, did you guys enjoy the live? I'm going to go home, put Speed Racer on, and go to sleep. You're not putting Speed Racer on. Come on. Why, I don't Why are you torturing me? I love Speed Racer. Did I hear someone say I was not hungry, not getting anything? I know! I had a couple bites. I got the chicken meatballs for myself. Because I knew Joe wouldn't it's like it. It's a good it. thing because the color's off. You're going to print a big D and frame for your kitchen? That's perfect. A D. Oh, a D. No. They don't have Ds. C's are orange. C's are orange. Make sure you get the color right. I don't have a D. Make sure you get the color right, though, on that. He's probably the department guy, the inspector itself. 
I don't think I've seen a D. I don't know. I've never seen a D. Usually to get shut down after the C. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining wait, us wait, on date night. This off, right? <laughs> you got that all set there, babe? You warm? You nice oh, my head's so very warm. I feel the sun to the pool on my head. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys for showing up. What do you think? New look? I think it's I think it's fabulous. It's actually really funny from the back because you really see the rings from the from back. The front, I don't have a ring in my face. But from the back, it's actually very poop emoji looking. <laughs> so funny. I can't. All right, guys. Thank you so much for the super chats. A Pooping. thumbs up. Don't forget the, the poop. Subs. Give me yes. the poop. Give me the poop. Thank you to my mods. Thank you to Joe for buying Thank you to my friends. Today. Thank you for our viewers. Thank you for Joe for wearing the poop emoji. You're welcome. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like a poop astronaut. You, you know what that, that, that kind of does look like, like an astronaut? I feel like a poop astronaut. Don't be a poop head. I'm a poop astronaut. Okay, Dupa. All right. We will talk to you as he loves the new hat. Perfect, Fafo. We will be talking Fafo, to you guys I got later. Your birthday gift. I know what I'm getting you. Oh, my God. Treat getting one too. I'm gonna get her the slippers. Oh, okay. The okay. poop slippers. Okay, okay. Later. So she can Have step a good in night. The pool. She can step Bye. in the poop.